Oh, you know, I read your book last night. Oh, so you're the one. <laughs> do you still uh, do you still counsel veterans? No, I don't. Why not? Well, I gave it up when my wife got sick. You ever wonder what your life would be like if you, uh, if you never met your wife? I wonder if I'd be better off without her. No, 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 I'm not saying, like, no. better off. I didn't mean it like It's all right. You know. It's an important question. Because you'll have bad times, but that'll always wake you up to the good stuff you weren't paying attention to. And you don't regret meeting your wife? Why? Because the pain I feel now? Oh, I got regrets, Will, but I don't regret a single day I spent with her. So when did you know, like, that she was the one for you? October 21st, 1975. Jesus Christ, you know the fucking day? Oh, yeah. Because it was game six of the World Series. Biggest game in Red Sox history? Yeah, sure. My friends and I had you know, slept out on the sidewalk all night to get tickets. You got tickets? Yep. Day of the game, we're sitting in a bar waiting for the game to start, and in walks this girl. It was an amazing game, though. You know, bottom of the eighth, Carbo tied it up at the 6-6. Six, six. It went to 12. Bottom of the 12th, in stepped Carlton Fisk. Old Pudge. Steps up to the plate. You know, he's got that weird stand. Yeah, yeah. And then, boom! He clocks it, you know. High, fly ball on the left field line. 35,000 people on their feet, yelling at the ball. But that's nothing, because Fisk, he's waving at the ball like a madman. Yeah, get over! Get over! Get over! And then it hits a foul pole. Oh, he goes apeshit, and 35,000 fans, you know, they charge the field, you know? Yeah, and he's fucking pulling oh, no, he's like, going, get, on the get out of the way, get out of the way! I can't fucking believe you had tickets in that fucking game! Yeah. Did you rush the field? Uh, no, I didn't rush the fucking field, I wasn't there. What? No, I was in a bar having a drink with my future wife. You missed Pudge Fist's home run? Oh, yeah. To have a fucking drink with some lady you never met? Yeah, but you should have seen her. She was a stunner. I don't care if Oh, fucking... no, no, she lit up the room. I don't Ooh. care if Helena Troy walks oh, into the Helena room. That's Troy. game six. No, oh, my was... God, and who are these fucking friends of yours? They let you get away with that? Uh, they had to. Wait, what, what did you say to them? I just slid my ticket across the table, and I said, sorry, guys, I gotta see about a girl. <laughs> I gotta go see about a girl? Yeah. That's what you said? I had And they let you get away with that? Oh, yeah, they saw in my eyes that I meant it. You're kidding me. No, I'm not kidding you, Will. That's why I'm not talking right now about some girl I saw at a bar 20 years ago and how I always regretted not going over and talking to her. I don't regret the 18 years I was married to Nancy. I don't regret the six years I had to give up counseling when she got sick. And I don't regret the last years when she got really sick. And I sure as hell don't regret missing a damn game. That's regret. Wow. Would have been nice to catch that game, though. I didn't know Pudge was going to hit a home run. <laughs> <laughs>